Words and phrases have a unique charm about them. They're not just vehicles of expression, but they shape our experiences and emotions. In this Word Power episode by English Plus, we're diving into an enchanting word that truly livens up our social interactions. Banter. This is your host, Danny, and this is English Plus Podcast. At its core, banter is defined as playful, friendly exchange of teasing remarks. It's that witty repartee at the coffee machine, the cheeky comments between friends during a game night, the light-hearted back and forth during a family dinner. However, as with any word worth its salt, banter transcends beyond its mere definition. Banter is more than just playful conversations. It's a social ballet. A dance of words where participants volley wit and humor back and forth. It adds a layer of vivacity to our dialogues, transforming ordinary conversations into memorable interactions. However, banter is not solely about humor. It also involves quick thinking, a sense of timing, and most importantly, a foundation of mutual respect and understanding among the participants. Let's dive into a few anecdotes that illustrate the essence of banter. First, let's consider a group of friends, Anna, Mark, Brian, and Lisa. Every Friday night, they gather at their favorite local diner. It's not the food that draws them, it's the joy of banter. The air becomes alive with their playful jibes and teasing remarks, full of laughter and camaraderie. Mark, another diet soda, trying to offset that double cheeseburger? Anna teases, sparking laughter around the table. Mark retorts, well, Anna, at least I'm not pretending that salad makes up for those three chocolate milkshakes. It's never mean-spirited, always light-hearted, and creates a delightful ambience that strengthens their bond. This story encapsulates the spirit of banter. It is about fun, camaraderie, and adding a spark of joy to our interactions. It creates a shared sense of enjoyment, enhancing our relationships by allowing us to connect on a lighter, more personal level. Next, let's look up at an office setting. Jenny and Sam work in the same department. Every day they engage in a bit of friendly banter. Late again, Sam? Did your alarm clock betray you again? Jenny might ask, a playful twinkle in her eye. Only because it's trying to keep up with your early bird habits, Jenny, Sam would retort. And they would both share a laugh. Their playful exchanges not only make the workplace more enjoyable, but also help alleviate stress and build a stronger, more collegial relationship. The magic of banter lies not just in the laughter it brings, but in the way it can lighten the mood and bring people closer. It gives us the space to playfully express ourselves, to showcase our wit and humor, and to engage with others in a fun and friendly manner. However, while banter is a delightful form of social interaction, it's also important to keep in mind that it should always be respectful and considerate. Good banter is rooted in understanding and mutual respect. It never crosses into the realm of causing discomfort or harm. It's always crucial to be aware of each other's boundaries and to ensure that our playful teasing doesn't turn into inadvertent hurt. In essence, banter is a dance of words that adds zest to our interactions. It's about embracing humor and lightheartedness in our conversations. It's about strengthening our connections with others and creating a shared space for laughter and enjoyment. So next time you're amidst a friendly gathering or a casual chat, why not add a dash of banter to spice things up? Playfully tease your friend about their well-known coffee obsession, engage in a witty back and forth about the latest movie, or share a light-hearted comment about the weather. Just remember to keep it respectful, fun, and within the boundaries of comfort for everyone involved. Remember, banter isn't just about words, it's about the shared experience of joy, camaraderie, and humor. It's an art of communication that celebrates the lighter side of life, strengthening bonds and spreading smiles along the way. So go ahead and indulge in the joy of banter. You'll find that not only does it make your conversations more lively and engaging, but it also adds a dash of joy and laughter to your life. And that's the true power of the word banter. It's not just a form of conversation, it's a way to build connections, share joy, and celebrate the lighter side of life. Banter away. 
Thank you for joining us on another enriching episode of English Plus Podcast. If this episode resonated with you or enriched your passion for the English language, please don't hesitate to follow us on your preferred podcast platform. We highly value your feedback. Your ratings and reviews not only help us refine our content, but they also allow us to connect with more language enthusiasts worldwide, amplifying our shared love for words. For those eager to delve deeper and unlock exclusive access to our special audio series and bonus episodes, consider becoming a patron on Patreon. By doing so, you're not just supporting our work, but also opening up a treasure trove of knowledge just waiting to be explored. Once again, I'm your host, Danny, grateful for your time and participation. Until we meet again in the next episode, remember, learning is a journey, and we're glad to be a part of yours. Signing off for now, see you next time on English Plus Podcast. Oh,